Considering symbol in the city of Long Beach, and now it's getting a second lease on life. Sky 9's Desmond Shaw takes a look at this world famous ship that's getting a Titanic sized makeover. Well, take a look at this grand old dame in the Long Beach Harbor. It's the Queen Mary, a storied boat that has sadly fallen on some tough times uh, over the last couple of decades. It was first set sail in 1936 and sailed across the Atlantic for more than 30 years between Great Britain and New York before coming here to its final resting place. Very important, during World War II, she shuttled troops to the front lines in Europe and was painted gray and known as the Gray Ghost. So a very uh, a vital part of a World War II. Now, after coming to Long Beach, it underwent a lot of renovations, including having the fuel tanks filled with mud, kind of to keep everything in place. A lot had to be done to make this boat uh, permanently moored here. It's been a museum, it's been a hotel that's had restaurants uh, here. It's just fallen into disrepair. The companies that have been managing it over the last few decades just have not done a very good job maintaining this boat. The city of Long Beach has taken it back and they're doing some emergency repairs at a cost of $25 million in the hopes of reopening uh, the ship later on this year to the public. And part of what they're doing, they had to remove all of these uh, lifeboats here. As I zoom in, you can see just how corroded they are so bad that they're in danger of actually falling on people that were uh, walking underneath the boat. So that's one of many safety repairs they're doing. It may need as much as $300 million in work, according to a one, inspe a one inspection. But regardless, here's to hoping they can uh, re restore this awesome old cruiser to its glory days. Taking a look at this from Sky9, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like, Desmond, to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, write us at lookatthis at cbs.com.